Matthew 14 and verse 26. And when the disciples saw him walking on the sea, they were troubled, saying, It is a spirit. And they cried out for fear. But straightway Jesus spake unto them, Be of good cheer, it is I, be not afraid. And oh my God oh Jesus and Peter answering him said Lord if that be thou bid me to come unto thee on the water and he said come and when Peter was come down out of the, the ship he walked on the water to go to Jesus <laughs> oh but when he saw the wind boisterous he was afraid and began to sink and he cried saying Lord save me and immediately, boy, that's quick, ain't that's it? Quick. Immediately, Jesus stretched forth his hand and caught him and said unto him, Oh, oh Jesus, and said unto him, O oh, thou of little faith, Wherefore did thou doubt? See, that's what a lot of people's going through today. They've got the faith to get out of the ship, but when they take and look at the situation that they're in, they look at the trouble that's coming their way, they lose the faith. We need to keep our eyes on Jesus. Praise God. Amen. Woo! Keep our that's eyes what on it's all about. Let's go to the next verse. Where did where, yeah. where, where, you leave off? Okay, there? Right here. What is it? Read verse that. number 32. And then when they were coming to the ship, the wind ceased. <laughs> and they that were in the ship came and worshipped him saying of a truth thou art the son of God <laughs> he is the son of God brother See, suddenly the storm stopped I mean I mean, yeah. talk about power talk about yeah. God's power talk about Jesus Christ being the son of God he, he, stopped, he stopped the storm Besides walking on the water, he stopped. I mean, it's incredible. Yeah, this, the, the power of Jesus Christ, the presence of God in Jesus Christ is something. If this doesn't give faith, I know the devil tries, to, tries for years to get me not to believe in this, this, particular, uh, this particular event of Jesus walking on water. And another yeah. event where he, where they were there in a boat and they had a terrible storm. storm. He's and, asleep. Yeah, and he's asleep and he got up and, and, and that storm was calmed oh. instantly. And they were trying to hit and also they found the boat already going to shore. That not only did the storm stop, but he, he put the boat to shore. Oh, so I mean uh, you 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 say, Well, I want some evidence. How can I believe in this Jesus anyway? Well, my goodness, this man this God worked all kinds of miracles. If we can't believe this, then there's something wrong with our intelligence. I love you know, you, Jesus. We, we don't. We, we don't. We're not using Lord. our mind. So anyway, the power of Jesus Christ, the the, the the definition of Him being divine and the Savior and the Son of God, is written all over His life. He just worked thousands and thousands of miracles. And this walking on water and this calming the sea, that ought to get our attention. Woo. Right. Glory to God. Yes, it would. You know, I just I get excited. You read the word, and you can't help but feel the power that comes from his word. And uh, if you've got prayer, I want to give the phone number right quick. It, uh, it's 528-4671, 528-4671. For people that's listening by radio, it don't see it on the screen. We love you. But we want to pray for you. We all together, we're brothers and sisters. You've got difficulties or suffering or some, some kind of a, 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 a tragedy or, or a catastrophe in your life, we're with you. Uh, God is with you, and we, we can pray together, and we can find aid and, and comfort in the presence of God and in the presence of uh, our love for one another. Amen. Amen. You know, just as this here, as Peter's, that we, we're all like Peter's. We all take spells, and we'll look around and see storms, the trouble, finances, sickness. And, you know, and we all fail, but we cannot give up. We start to sink. We, start to sink. we get scared. We get scared. And, and we call upon Jesus, and uh, we and need to call upon the Lord. And that's he'll... when he will reach down <laughs> in yeah. his hand, yeah. just like he did, Woo. and he will help you. He'll do it. Amen. Because he is reaching out for you. He's there to reach out and help you, whatever it takes. We've got some more prayer requests coming. Amen. And uh, we'll get John hooked up to a mic here. But uh, just call in whatever your needs are. And uh, we just want to send this all out tonight to the shut-ins and uh, the ones in the jails and the nursing homes and the hospitals. It, uh, we love you. And I appreciate uh, 
each and every one that listens because we get so many calls it's just traveling down the highway on the interstate that's a blessing say they enjoy the program and then the one that called right back there stopped again and recalled and wanted prayer All right. so you know the Lord is dealing with people I yes, don't sir. know where they're coming from they may be traveling from California but it don't matter where you're at he knows where you're at All right. so he knows. whatever your needs are just call in it's 528-4671 and uh, we're going to take and uh, get these prayer requests in and then uh, I'd like well, to tell you tell you something that um, uh, a week ago God knew that you would be watching this program oh praise God uh, a month ago he knew you were going to watch this program right. a thousand years ago he knew he, for all eternity God knew that this program <laughs> would be in your view that this would be your opportunity, your invitation well, to, to come to the Lord Jesus Christ, to believe in him, all right. to put your, ha put your life in his hands, right. the comfort, the strength, the power of the Savior of the world. Right. And this program tonight in God's providence has been designed to talk to you tonight. <laughs> For all eternity, God has, has had in his mind and his plan that you would have your TV on tonight. For this station, for us to, to oh, be here uh, to be the spokesman.